Hello, my lovelies. Welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the monthly reading for all zodiac signs. This is going to be for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Before we get into your reading, Sagittarius, I just want to take a couple of minutes to hope and wish that all of you watching and your family are doing well. Um, just want to, uh, you know, take the time to remind you guys of how important it is at this point in time in our lives to put love out into the universe. We are currently dealing with a lot of transformative type of energy, uh, a lot of changes that are coming in that are going to continuously keep unfolding. And I think that it's very important to come from a loving place to not let hate blind us. You, you can't fight hate with hate. It only creates chaos. I think that it's important for us to take a couple of minutes and step back and vibrate to the highest of our frequency, our natural birth frequency, which is that of love. Be patient, be compassionate, help those that need help. Um, you know, we're, we're dealing with a lot of craziness. Um, and I think that a lot of people, you know, we all have opinions and we're very intense and, you know, we're dealing with everyone's a little bit on edge. Um, but I think that it is important to put love and compassion and understanding. It's okay to agree to disagree. You know, you don't have to be all upset because people don't see your point of view. Um, I think that's part of the problem. You know, at these times that we're living, uh, it, it's, it's, it's just, anyways, I just want to take this time to remind you guys how important it is to create and start change. And change starts within us first. Um, we have to change within us to be able to experience change in the outer, in the outer field, in the outer sense. Um, so anyways, let's get into your reading Sagittarius. Sorry about that whole long spiel. <laughs> All right, let's see what Spirit has for you guys for this month of June 2020. First card, Six of Wands, victory, feeling victorious, feeling like uh, things are starting to move in a positive way for you. You have the Four of Cups here as an obstacle, a bit of boredom for some of you guys. It could be that you were laid off or you haven't been working for others of you. You have two fours, actually, so it could represent... Uh, stability finally coming through for some of you guys. You have the Four of Wands in the past and passing with the Six of Wands victory. Uh, try not to stay in the past. Try to live in the present, Sagittarius. Let go of lingering feelings of people that have done you wrong, of people that are constantly out to get you. The more you focus on that, the more energy you put towards that, that's exactly what you're pulling towards the manifestation of your present. So you got to let go of that. Keep in mind, Sagittarius, that um, Jupiter, which is your planet, your ruling planet, is uh, very benevolent. So right now you could be experiencing, like I said, uh, blessings or hidden blessings coming towards you, but at the same time, in order to continuously keep overflowing that type of energy, you got to think the right way. So be positive. You have the eight of coins. Working out a situation or finances finally stabilizing for you. You have the page of swords. Someone's stalking you. Someone's looking at your social media. Someone is trying to... Uh, this could be you as well because this is your crowning energy, Sagittarius. And you have temperance here, which is your card, which speaks about healing, which speaks about balance. Balance is very important. Um, for some of you guys, it could be that you're still stalking your ex-partner, that you're still looking to see what's going on in their life. You have the four of swords taking some time or pausing, uh, analyzing, internalizing, healing is what they're saying. You have the Magician card, and this is the energy that is currently influencing and around you. So Jupiter is definitely amplifying that energy for you, Sagittarius. Put your intention and your thoughts towards the right things, meaning towards the things you want to make happen, not what you don't want to make happen. The Magician is all about having all the elements, having the blessings, having uh, your spirit guides being present, guiding you, trying to 
make room for you, open doors for you. Um, but again, you got to embrace that. You got to acknowledge that energy. You also have the strength card, overcoming difficulties, being stronger for that. And finally, the seven of coins, seven of pentacles. So stop reliving in the past, Sagittarius. Move on from the past. So if you are currently dealing with looking towards your partner or stalking your partner, stop doing that. Um, what you're doing is basically you are viewing the past as something that was the best thing that ever happened to you. The best is yet to come for you, Sagittarius. So it's time for you to shake that off, um, count your blessings, and expect more blessings. Okay? I hope you guys enjoyed this reading, and we'll see each other soon. Bye.